it's PressLayDeckDoubtGames.com here, and today is Science Sunday, and we're going to be doing another Tinker Crate. So we really like Tinker Crates because they're kind of a mix of Science Sunday and Craft Monday, so mm -hmm. they can go up on either day, mm -hmm. and they're just really, really fun. This is our third one, I think. I think so. And we've been really, really loving them so far. They're super duper great, and I'm really glad to be getting these because they mix science and crafts perfectly, and we'd yeah. love to do both of those we things. We love both of those things, so it's kind of cool to get a mix of both of them. Yeah. Uh, and this week, uh, month, this week, this month we're doing uh, Pepper's Ghost. Yes. In uh, the Tinker Crate, Technically which... Technically we are doing Pepper's Ghost this week, though. We, that's true. <laughs> we have uh, two videos, I think, already that cover Pepper's Ghost. Two videos? What's, what's the first one? Well, we did one where we did the, uh, the little, like, iPhone, oh, iPad okay, thing. Oh, that one, yeah. Okay. Right? And it kind of explained a little... Or we just really showed that. We didn't talk about Pepper's Ghost then. We just kind of showed that effect. Yeah. And then the next week on Science Sunday, that was a Craft Monday because yes. we built a little thing for the lens. And there's one that comes with this kit we'll show you. Uh, and then the next Science Sunday, I think, we explained how Pepper's Ghost work. And that's where we set up and showed, like, all the stuff with the Doctor Who yeah. made the ghost weeping angel and stuff. Mm -hmm. So there'll be a link in the doobly-doo. And on the end card. And on the end card to both of those videos, which will explain the science a lot yes. of what's going on here. Mm -hmm. I don't know how much of the science we'll go into here because you can go watch those videos and see a bunch of it. But yeah. the the thing we love about Tinker Crate is similar to uh, Spangler Science. Yeah. Is they do explain what's happening, so you get a lot of the stuff to explain, and you get to build little, really, really cool little kits, right? To, yeah. To put it together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So let's uh, let's put this first thing together. So we're going to build kind of a little box that does a Pepper's Ghost effect, mm -hmm. um, just like the other Tinker Crates. You have one project that you know comes with really detailed instructions and pre-built and pre-cut things that you can fold and make one little craft, like the little hand crank ball elevator yeah. thing we made. So we'll make that thing, mm -hmm. um, and then we'll come back and we'll talk a little bit about yeah. what it is. And just so you know, Cooper is not here because this would be a little bit too complicated. Yeah, I think this one goes a little far for Cooper. But yeah, yeah for me and you, I think we'll knock this one out. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. It's this really cool little box, and what's really cool about Tinker Crate is they let you get hands-on in building it, and yeah. while you're building it, you're kind of learning how these concepts work and how like Pepper's Ghost works while you're building the little projector box, which yeah. is really really cool. No, I agree. Like if they had just sent this box to you and you look at it and you see this super cool effect, that would be pretty neat. And that's yeah. how most people do science experiments and science demonstrations, mm -hmm. right? What we love about this and what we get from Spangler is that while we were building this, we could talk about, oh, why do you think this goes here? And why do you think this angle matters? And why do you put the light here? Mm -hmm. You can talk about as you're building it, how the effect works. And I love it. Like, I think yeah. it's really awesome. And this thing works fantastic. Mm -hmm. Like it really, it's almost not even a ghost, right? Mm -hmm. It's so, Whoa. it lights up so much. It's a, uh, it looks like a real image, right? Yeah, it's Except funny. they pass through each other. Yeah. So it came with two ping pong balls, and you put one in one place in the box and one in the other place in the box, and then when you turn the light on, you see the ghost image of one of them and the real image of the other, and they can kind of pass through each other and stuff. That's we'll funny. try and shoot a little bit and show you. So talk for two seconds about how Pepper's Ghost works while I play. <laughs> okay, so kind of how Pepper's Ghost works is really similar to the balloon signs video that we did. <laughs> What? Oh, that was so cool. What did you do? <laughs> it did. Like the white one kind of went up and like dropped down. It was kind of floating and hovering up on the thing. It was awesome. Yeah. Because like... it's. <laughs> so it's uh, it, you're you're inverting it, right? So it's yeah. on this plane here. Mm -hmm. It's sitting flat on this, and yeah. you're bouncing it up and projecting it here, mm -hmm. right? And so when it rolls around on the flat place that it's sitting, it goes up and down up here because you're kind of inverting it. I yeah. totally didn't expect that, right? So when you make it roll back towards the back of the box, it floats up in here where yeah. you're looking at it. So it looks really, it's amazing. Okay, I'm sorry, go back yeah, and talk about sorry. how Pepper's Ghost works. It looks kind of like you're playing with one of those flight simulators because you're like moving it around. How does it, it does look like a flight simulator, like you're doing a 360, or like it's zero G almost. Mm -hmm. uh, how does it uh, tie into the uh, popping balloons with light thing that we did the other day? Well, it was because like we said, some things absorb some things absorb light and turn it into heat, and some um, things 
not they don't pass through light. Some light passes through things, mm -hmm. or or um, some things absorb light instead, yeah, and, and sometimes it bounces of, off. There you go. Um, and sometimes it does a little bit of both. So what's happening here is some of the light is just bouncing off the plexiglass, and then some of the light is going through the plexiglass, and then hitting the ghost. Yep. And then bouncing back into your eye, so it looks like that's there. Yeah, so you got like your eyes here, mm -hmm. right? And then there's one of the balls that's right here. So there's a there's a piece of glass that, mm -hmm. that sits like this, right, or, or something clear, right? And so here, this ball, the light passes through the glass and hits your eye. Yeah. Right. And then there's a ball down here, and that light comes up and bounces off of the glass and hits your eye, mm -hmm. right? And then those two things combine together where your eye is, and sort of you see them both. Yeah. And then depending on which one has more light on it, you see that one more clearly. Yeah. And you can, uh, like some of these, you can put a dimmer, like on the light here, we just turn it off and on. But if you could put a dimmer on it, then you can control like how bright the, each thing is, right? It's yeah. really, we may try and do that with this. That's mm -hmm. the beauty, again, a beautiful thing about Tinker Crate is you can get into it and play around with it, and we can put a dimmer on there. Yeah. And uh, we could probably even do something with a little bits mm -hmm. and sort of have the little bits play along and so the other thing it comes with really cool instructions about how you can you put those two ping pong balls in to play around but it yeah. comes with instructions about how to make your own things and make your own background and make a little ghost and there's little holes these little x holes mm -hmm. you can poke one of these straws through here and put your little figure that you make like a little oh, paper girl cool. almost on it and then you can move it around using this mm -hmm. and have her kind of dancing around on the background and stuff and so we're definitely going to do that um this is a really awesome kit yeah. uh so we'll show you a little bit of what this effect looks like and then it came with a couple of other uh pepper's ghost based illusions and we'll show how some of those look too yeah cool let's do that mm -hmm. uh, it comes with this other piece that's a little viewer mm -hmm. right and it has a piece of glass in it as well you know, very similar to uh, what we did with the other one and it has this little viewer on top and it comes with a little piece of tissue paper it's kind of mm -hmm. like wax papery kind of stuff and you can put that on here and draw a picture on it yeah and then when you look through you'll see that picture superimposed uh, mm -hmm. over as a ghost image kind of over whatever you're looking on which is really neat and then it also they have you can take videos on your phone um, almost like uh, the little phone illusion thing that you'll mm -hmm. see uh, in the end card for us. Um, and when you take one of those, you can put your phone up here and then it'll put that movie over whatever you're looking at. Right? Mm -hmm. And you can even shoot your own movies on your phone and put them on here yeah. and, and play around and have them do a superimposed thing. Yeah. So we'll take a shot of that and kind of show how that looks. I think that's really neat. I wonder what would happen if you took like different people like walking through something <clears throat> And then you kept layering them over and over and over and over mm -hmm. until you had like five layers of mm -hmm. stuff happening Like at the ghosts same time. passing over in each other. Yeah, yeah, that would be really awesome. So I think the phone thing is really cool to be able to look at that. It also came with one of the little things that you use for your phone. Mm -hmm. So if you watch our video on the phone uh, uh, holograms, yes. uh, you'll see how to use one of these. And it comes with one that's pretty easy to kind of fold and put together. Yeah. Um, and then tons of instructions to do even more stuff, right? There's yeah. a lot more that we're going to kind of play around with here and mm -hmm. do some things, right? Yeah. So I, I love it. I thought this was a yeah. great crate, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Pepper's Ghost is a cool illusion and the, the cool thing about pepper's ghost is that where do they use pepper's ghost uh they use pepper's ghost in disney actually which ride um haunted mansion haunted mansion haunted mansion spoilers yeah but, so when you're riding yeah. in the ride and you see the ghosts like dancing around in the dining room yeah. or sort of doing the dance those ghosts are really up above you or down below you and you're looking through a pane of glass and the reflex you're seeing the reflection of those ghosts out there on the floor yeah. Right, it uses this exact same thing. That yeah, spin around. yeah, it totally uses this exact same and thing. Also, I think it's like the same thing at the mirrors at the end, with the mirrors at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right. Mm -hmm. You can see through, and some light bounces off, and you see a reflection, and some light comes through. Yeah, yeah same yeah. thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, cool. So I really loved it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Uh, we'll go shoot a little bit more footage. You'll probably see somewhere around here of playing around with a couple of these other things. Mm -hmm. um, and I think we're good. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye, guys.